do I sing? I sing because I know that I have something to say and I know that it's important. There's a challenge involved in singing classical music. It's the memorization component, it's the style component, it's the component of actually communicating uh, what the composer has asked of you to communicate. One is constantly thinking about your focus. At this moment, what is the character thinking? At this moment, how would the character sit? At this moment, how would the character look into the eyes of someone that she loves? And so when you have those things running in your mind, the music lends itself to be sung. I'm involved with the Color of Music Festival because I think it's a fantastic premise. The idea is quite amazing. The Color Music exists to showcase the extraordinary talents people of African ancestry have contributed to the classical genre. We are truly the largest black classically presenting organization. The talent of the musicians that perform in the Color Music Festival is truly global. From the natural voice, having Miss Laquita Mitchell, who's a phenomenal soprano, to conservatory trained musicians that come from the Curtis Institute, Oberlin, Juilliard, Manhattan School of Music, the Royal Conservatory. I, I can go on and on and on. I think something like this can thrive because the importance of inclusion and diversity is needed. And with classical music, I think there's, it's like 0.01% of orchestras have people of color. So like many black institutions that start, it's out of necessity. We have to create our own institutions when they're not giving us access. The classical music world is a very complicated, expensive world. That's where it started, by aristocrats who used to pay very poor composers to do things that they could show off their wealth. So it still carries all of those standards of what classical music should be and how it should be presented. These people of African ancestry, many of whom can't get the covenant spots and, and there are limited spots in orchestras around the world, this is an opportunity for them to present these huge works. Ms. Jessie Norman is probably one of the most celebrated African-American sopranos of our time. She has sung in every major opera house there is in the world. So at the age of 14, I was able to meet Jessie Norman and then I was able to see her on stage. I'm a kid from Brooklyn. I had no idea that that was actually a possibility for me. So the importance of diversity on stage, it's, it's paramount. It must happen. It's really, really important that young people understand that there is a possibility. When I walk out on stage, I'm thinking that there probably will be someone in the audience who's never seen anyone look like me that is doing what I'm doing. So I need to always put my best foot forward when I'm performing.